Hi everyone on YouTube. Um, <coughs> I thought I'd do a YouTube video uh, because basically I um, I sent Aaron a, um, a message the other day, a couple of days ago, um, because um, I never because um, I felt sorry for him basically because he's not on the holiday with us. Um, so I messaged him saying, "Hi, how are you?" And I also said um, the reason I the reason I haven't invited you on the holidays I was expecting an apology off you and that and um, this was on Monday I sent him this message uh, yesterday I, I thought it was a really nice message to be honest I was just I was just telling him how um, how much um, I was just telling him that I um, that I still worry about him and that and I still think about him and I still worry about him and hope he's okay because a few weeks ago someone called Tony in Redditch, Tony Fletcher told me that Aaron was all alone and he was crying and he was depressed and this that and the other and um, so I did start feeling sorry for him again because he was telling Tony he didn't have any mates and that and, and, um, and, Tony, and he asked Tony for money for a flat um, and Tony apparently said to him, um, I'm not going to go and borrow you any more money, Aaron, because I'll never get it back. And apparently Aaron started crying and saying he's going to take it out of me. Um, so anyway, um, I hadn't heard anything of Aaron. And I, was, I, I, wasn't, I was a little bit worried about him hearing some of those things. Um, yeah, I was, to be honest, because I'm a, a very caring person. Um, and then the other day I messaged him to see if he was okay because I thought he's put, we're going on the holiday and he isn't. Um, so although he caused us a lot of problems on the holiday because he was a, he put his name down as the lead person for the holiday in, despite the fact that Lee paid for the holiday. Um, he rang up, he used Lee's bank card, rang up, booked the, ho booked the holiday and put his name down rather than Lee's name down. So basically we had... We had like, we had to ring, because Lee's got autism and other disabilities, so we had to ring up Lee's social worker and try and sort it out, and Lee's social worker had to ring Aaron, and it took us about three hours um, before we could get the keys to the caravan, because, um, because they were refusing to, they were refusing to hand over the keys, um, <coughs> They're refusing to hand over the keys because of Aaron being the lead name down on there. So Lee social worker rang up, rang up um, Aaron, and he agreed to give the keys. So um, so that was a, a big yeah, that was a big drama the other day Monday. Um, and then I started feeling sorry for Aaron. I don't know why. God knows why. <laughs> Um, because of what Tony told me a few weeks ago, about two weeks, two, two weeks ago, yeah, about two weeks ago. So I messaged Aaron to see if he was okay, and then the other day I had this really nasty, vile message, another nasty message off the person who's got back with Vigan Junior, um, telling me I'm pathetic, I'm, I'm this, that, and the other, I'm sad, he wants to punch my face in, calling me vermin, this, that, and the other, and I thought. I mean, it did make it did make me upset for 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 maybe half an hour or something. But then I thought, well, they, them two can't be too happy if he's take if he's having a go at me. Plus, I wasn't saying to Aaron I was taking him back. All I was asking him is he is he okay? Because I'm a very caring person, so I was simply asking, is he okay? Um, I thought I can't believe some, how nasty some people are. Because Aaron's obviously put him up to that. I just can't believe how nasty, how vile, how nasty some people are. Um, yeah, he was basically saying he wants to punch my lights out and that, and he hates me with that and the other. I don't know, maybe Aaron talks about me to him to wind him up, I don't know. Um, because I've never even met this junior, so I don't know why he hates me. Uh, so anyway, this Junie hates me, but I've never met him. I thought, I thought, what's he going on about? I haven't even said that I want to get back with Aaron. All I've said, is, all I've asked Aaron is, is he okay? You know, and I hope, I hope he, um, 
finds happiness, that kind of thing. That's the message I sent him. I hope he was okay. So I really don't, I don't know where this is coming from. I mean, I'm happy with Daniel, so, um, so why would I want to get back with Aaron? So I think they've just got sad lives. And I think it's a real coincidence how, how Aaron and, how Aaron and Junior have got back together on the 8th of May, which is the exact same day that we go, that we went, that we've come to Butlin Skegness. Um, I think that's really sad that they've, um, I think that's really sad that Aaron's done that. Um, he's obviously done that to, you know, he's obviously, he's obviously planned that. He's obviously thought, well, if I'm not coming on this holiday, if he doesn't, if he doesn't let me come on this holiday, then I'm going to get back with Junior. Um, that just kind of sums Aaron up, really, how, how his mentality is. Um, it's all very attention-seeking behaviour. It's all very uh, reaction, action and reaction kind of thing. It's what I can do to hurt that person the most. Um, and I've had that for about nearly three years now. Um, 20th of May will be the third... I think it's around the 20th of May, it'll be the third year that I've been with Aaron, so I haven't seen him since about February, but um, it's come up to nearly three years that I've known him. Well, you can't really say it's three years because it's about three months less than three years, isn't it? So it's like two months and some. Anyway, my point is that Aaron is just a raw person and I never want to get back with him, and that is the reason I'm doing this video to assure him and Junior that I never want to get back with him. He's a loser, they're both losers, they're both vile people. Um, I only want a nice, I've said this already in my video, so I don't know why, you know, I don't know why he doesn't know this, maybe he hasn't watched my videos perhaps, but the only person I want in my life is a nice, kind, caring partner really, um, I've already got caring, kind friends and I've got a good family who support me as well, um, and I've, as I says on my other video, I'm thinking about um, breeding some pedigree cats um, over the next couple of months. I've been looking into savannah cats, um, which are very pricey, but obviously if the cats are very pricey, the kittens are going to be very pricey, so it could be a good business idea. Um, yeah, so I'm not angry, I'm not bitter. All I was trying to, all I was trying to message Aaron was to see if he was okay. Um, I know on some of the videos I have been angry and I have been bitter, but I'm not anymore because I've been praying for him for so many hours. Oh, it's cold, aren't you? I've been praying for him for so many hours and I feel sorry for him because I know that if you keep trying to cause problems for other people, then eventually you, your life's going to fall apart. You can't keep being nasty to people all the time and expect to get away with it. Um, so... So yeah, so I wish them to, I wish them to well. I, yeah, I'm not. But um, and I'm looking forward to seeing Daniel soon after the holiday and skyping Daniel because I haven't been able to Skype Daniel while I've been here because there's no Wi-Fi here, so I haven't been able to Skype Daniel, which has been really annoying. Uh, yeah, so mm. looking forward to seeing him. <laughs> he lives in uh, London, in Bromley, in London. So. Mm. It's a bit of a distance, but it's doable. I mean, I live in Droitwich, um, which is in Worcestershire. So it's a distance of about 164 miles. He, he looked it up and it's 164 miles from his to mine, which is quite a distance, but um, as I was thinking earlier, that's probably a good thing in some ways, because um, when I've been with really clingy people in the past, like Aaron for instance, and other, other exes in the past that have been really clingy, I found that as soon as they move into your home, they not straight away, but after so many months, they, they, their attention wanders elsewhere to other men. So, um, so yeah. So, um, 
so it might be a good thing in some ways. Plus, it's e it'd be easy for. It's be good for me to have more time as well to get over my past and all the problems I've had in my past. Um, yeah. So. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing him after a holiday. <laughs> I'm looking forward to going to London and seeing him after the holiday. Because I don't need to live in my past, my past is my past and he's my future, he, Daniel is my future. So I don't need to live in the past. Um, I don't want to live in the past. See they might be living in the past by messaging me, they're trying to, it feels like they're trying to bring me into the past. All I was doing, I wasn't trying to get back with Aaron, All I was, if I wanted Aaron to, to get, if I wanted to get back with Aaron I'd have invited him to this holiday at the end of the day, wouldn't I? I don't want to get back with Aaron, Aaron has done me nothing but pain and suffering and cheating and stealing and lo loads of shit and loads of crap. And I don't want to get back with that person. I want to meet a decent person. And I think Daniel is a decent person. He's a nice guy. He's a really nice guy. And we've been Skyping for hours on the phone. Oh, it's cold. And like, um, yeah. Actually, I'm gonna sky. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this YouTube in my room. In my in my room actually, because it's too cold out here. <laughs> this is the view. The view. I'm in that room with the window open because I like my window open all the time. Oh fuck, I just dropped my phone on the blooming concrete. I'm trying to carry everything, I've got my tea in one hand and the phone in the other hand. I'm doing a YouTube video, Mum, but. I'm out. I was outside and it's cold. I'm doing it in there. No, I'm still on here. So what was I saying? Um, there's my mum's room. There's Lee's room. My room's a mess, as you can see. I've got some Cadbury cream eggs on them. <laughs> and the bed, which I'm probably going to eat later. Um, I like Cadbury cream eggs. Um, so yes, I'm looking forward to seeing Daniel um, after the holiday, and um, I don't need to be reminded of the past. Past is the past, and it stays in the past. Um, because Aaron's not a very nice person, uh, and Junior isn't either. I think Junior seems to be like really horrible. Um, I mean, they're both nasty in different ways. Aaron's very sneaky and very sly, and very. He plans everything in his mind, he thinks what he's going to do to hurt hurt people all the time. Whereas I think Junior just explodes. Um, and I wonder how them two will get on, because like, Junior seems quite violent, and Aaron seems, and Aaron pushes people to the very limit of their patience. So that's going to be interesting how them two get on. But I'm not interested in them two, so I'm happy with Daniel, so, you know. So this is my tiny room. It's literally that small. I can put my foot on one side of the wall and my other foot on the other side of the wall. It's so tiny. But I'm only here till Sunday because we're going back Sunday. <laughs> it was meant to be Monday, but Gary can't bring us back on Monday because he's working, so he's going to bring us back on Sunday. Um, my swimming trunks are dry in there. Um, because we, we're, oh, it's, it's that pool is so awesome. It's like, it was so sick. It was like, whoa. There's like so many water slides and there's a vortex and air. What's it called now? That air one. Um, <laughs> yeah. It's like really fast, really awesome slides. Better than better than Blackpool. Um, the best I've been on there. Yeah. Yeah. And it's all included in the price. It's quite good here as well. Um, and tomorrow we're going to go on the fun fair, and um, I haven't done my Tai Chi yet. Have I? We're going to go on the fun fair tomorrow and go to the beach tomorrow as well. 
and I think we're going to get to the market and um, I've said to my mum I want to get to the pool again before we go back on Sunday so probably Saturday we'll probably get to the pool again um, me and my mum went on some slides as